Hello everyone, with update 6.3.2 in Star Wars The Old Republic, we got a brand new batch of cosmetic items in the game, uh, all of them cartel market items, and one of them being a trooper set. As many of you know, my favorite character is the trooper, the vanguard trooper, and this is actually uh, the main armor set that she normally wears. It's an old PvP set um, that can now be crafted by most crafters, but I've loved this set for a very long time and I've kind of been hoping they would eventually release something kind of similar, but uh, with updated textures, because when you scroll in close, you can kind of start seeing a lot of those, those pixels there. Recently, they did, I'm very excited about it. So this is the new armor set. This is called the Frontline Scourges Armor Set. It's, as far as I can tell, it doesn't have any direct one-to-one references to the star wars universe um if you guys have any guesses feel free to guess in the comments below i've heard some people say it kind of reminds them of uh doom as <laughs> doom troopers and it sometimes kind of reminds them of the the dark troopers from the mandalorian and so let's take a quick look at some of the features that this has one of the biggest one apart from just generally being a high resolution high quality high textured a trooper armor set with a mix of kind of heavy bits as well as unarmored bits uh, in all the black sections there. It also has a neat little animation. Whenever you draw your weapon, the uh, small lights on the side of the helmet light up in white. These do not change color with the color of your color crystal. They just remain a static white color. I also wanted to show you that it does dye quite nicely. Let's pick up a quick dye here. So I'm going to buy this uh, bright red and dark red dye. and we'll unify the whole set. So a majority, uh, I'd say about half the set dies. Um, the parts that don't die are the black slash dark gray uh, sections in between. So anywhere that you see bright red, that's the primary color and the places with dark red, that's the secondary color. So you totally can dye this suit to get some, get some flavor colors in there, but you won't be able to dye the entire thing. I do once again, really like the set. I have a feeling I'm going to try and make an, an outfit for this, uh, for my, my main character here. Cause I think she, she'd really like something like that. Hope you guys enjoyed this quick preview of it. I will attach one more thing at the end of this video, and that is how this character will sound in a cutscene. I've seen what the Dreadmasters made Kefis do on a station. We can't let them overrun Belsavis. I've seen what the Dreadmasters made Kefis do on a station. We can't let them overrun Belsavis. Um, one other thing I did want to show you if you're considering purchasing this one is that depending on your weapon, you may have some, some clipping issues in the back. This is the life of the the trooper with a with a backpack it's just just how it'd be and i also wanted to show you while you're kicking around here that there's also a new blaster rifle out so that would be for the vanguard as well as for the operative uh, this is called the frontiersman blaster rifle it comes with a uh, laser sight built in in terms of animation and that little laser sight will change color with your color crystal, I just popped a blue one in there to match my armor set. 